This video will review the Submit Case Package section for the case submission process. Your hard work has now paid off and after completion of the previous sections you will be able to submit your case. Start this process by ensuring all of the tabs on the side of the screen except for the Submit Case Package tab have been completed and that there are green check marks next to each. You will be asked to provide your current email address. This will be the email address that you will receive confirmation or any further information regarding your case submission and the course you have registered for. It is important that you provide an email address that you check on a regular basis. Next, please use the case submission checklist link located here to make sure you have completed all of the necessary steps in the case submission process. As you can see, the checklist is broken up into different sections of the case submission package. This is a very helpful list that will allow you to pick up on anything you may have missed. When all of the other check marks are present and you have reviewed the checklist, click the submit box. As a reminder, after you finalize and submit your case online, you may access your pathology verification consent form from the case data entry page here.